So you see this new video, put the phone down, he's like licking the phone, you're like a cyborg, you can't even see it. Your phone has so much porn on it, you can't even put it down. It's like, they rub it in your face, you're a freaking cyborg. And you don't have to like it, you're a silly human slave, put your fucking phone down. You have more sex with your phone than you do with real people now. So take a look. You're already a robosexual, most of you. Uh, you can't go anywhere without your cell phone because the porn is so whatever. You know, it's it's that's just it. It's whatever at the end of your at the end of your device. It, it's like a dick in your hand. So the robosexuals uh, is actually you. This is you. This is actually, you're in the future right now. You're the robosexual and you can't see it. So, you know, you don't go anywhere without your device. You're chipped a hundred which way from Sunday. And the minute you get in your car, with it's, it's all linked up with GPS now. You know, it doesn't matter where you go. The Wi-Fi has you. And uh, you can't live without your Wi-Fi. So, you're already on time. Or you're in trouble, you don't get your check, somebody doesn't pay you, you don't get your money on time, whatever. Heaven needs to come to earth, people. Alright? We could take over the world once you wake up and realize that you get summoned to court because you're dead. You're officially dead. You're a robot. Okay? You, no matter what, you won't sit here from home making videos pointing at the obvious that every compass is pointing to the Holy Grail. And when enough of us wake the fuck up, we're going to get there and get everybody eternal life. It's just that simple. And I know everybody you know is fucking retarded. Okay, then just make some fucking videos. Make some fucking videos pointing to the holy grail. And that everybody's a fucking robosexual right now. It's crazy. Their wife or whatever go on the road. And then you have your internet sex or whatever. In the old days, it was over the phone. You know what I'm saying? Now we got videos and shit. So what I'm saying is that Everybody's become robosexuals and can't see it. It's right there hiding in plain sight. Okay. You're a fucking robosexual. You're dead. You're lost at sea. You're officially dead. You're a zombie. You have no blood to spill on bringing forth heaven on earth because you're fucking dead. As you see, the Satan horns in the Credit Karma commercial. It's kind of funny. That's as above, so below. With the thumb in and the thumb out, that's as within, so without. That's I love you in sign language. It's kind of funny. Everybody worships Satan. They can't even see it. You put on your black satanic robe at graduation. Every word you speak is a magic spell. You took your test with your number two shit pencil. You're so filthy satanic and necrophiliac sick it goes beyond measure. The devil already has your soul. Your parents gave it up willingly. Look it up. You're a monster by legal definition. You're lost at sea and officially dead. You're so filthy, retarded, and necrophiliac sick it goes beyond measure. <laughs> So the truth is hiding in plain sight. You don't have to like it. That says gay men. Look it up. Game is gay men. So gay men night. You see all the rainbow colors and stuff? You know, the rainbow coalition. There's a hidden undertone. You see the center of the plane, the flat board. All these board games are telling you that at the very center, you see the candy cane in his hand? That's showing you that Jesus the Son places his light into the center of the flat earth plane. You see the rainbow, the swastika? This spinning around, around, around. It's always the same shit. You're on the chessboard. And you're a pawn in the game. And you see this right here? The green astrolite coming out of the black hole sun. Uh, you know, I was just searching board games. And this is what comes up. So, it's got a hidden undertone. The green astral jet shooting out of the center of the flat earth plane. This is where you need to get to before you're dead. And drink from the living waters. Your pair of dice. Your pair of dice. And uh, you need to get here before you're dead or you're going to be picked up by the Pac-Man moon that's going to come around and suck up your soul or the spirit rover. This is the game of life that you're in. You need to get to the center of the flat earth plane. You bob for apples. You know, you close your eyes, you make a wish, you focus on the black sun. You bow your head in prayer to the black sun. It's that Jesus the sun is being 
eaten by the black sun through the Holy of Holies at the center of the flat earth plane, you don't have to like it. It is just, just it is that simple. It's on every freaking thing that you see. How you don't see it, I don't get it. You see this Jumanji. You see the green astral jet coming out of the black hole sun at the center of the flat earth plane. There is no way to fuck this up. It's sort of like Christmas. You open up your present day, your box of horrors. And every compass is pointing to the Holy Grail at the center of the flat earth plane. You bow your head in prayer to that black sun. You close your eyes. You make a wish to that black sun. You throw a coin in the wishing well for that black sun. I'm telling you, you need to get to the center of the flat earth plane where every compass points you before you're dead. I'm going there in a couple of years. If you want to go there with me, type into your YouTube search engine, Blood Over Intent. Scroll down. You'll see all of us spilling up our blood to bring forth heaven on earth. And unless your blood's be beside my own, you can't come with me. I'm not taking no fucking retards with me. I can prove you're not moving with your leg if they're not, not. See that light called the North Star in the middle of the sky like a bullseye. It's gonna be there the rest of your life. It ain't moving and neither are you and the rest of the earth that would be incongruent with the fact that you'd have to be assuming that North Star. desire popcorn necklaces you don't have to like it everybody gets a court summons at some point in their life and they're like holy fuck they're summoned to court for a ticket whatever it is whatever it is people get court summons because you're legally dead officially you're lost at sea you only summons the dead it's clear you're lost at sea officially dead you only summons the dead you're a monster by legal definition you're lost at sea you gave up the land you gave up your soul the devil already has you in the vatican and you're oblivious to what's going on you're legally dead you're a fucking retard you better get to my channel for truth immediately and see the holy hole's been blocked off from you you're like an aborted baby fetus you need to get to the holy grail before you're dead you've been locked up here in the land of the dead so you'll notice about the game Agony, all the mouths and the teeth and the gums. It's because every word you speak is a magic spell. You learned spell casting in school and you took your test with your number two shit pencil. You sit in a pew, it's the ash trailing light coming out of the black hole sun. And everybody only focuses on total shit and lies, the space station and all that. It's all fake. Everything's fake. There's a dome up there. The earth is not floating through space as an accident. You're not made from monkeys. Everything you think you know to be true is the reverse of truth. The devil already has your soul in the Vatican and your parents gave it up willingly. Now you're lost at sea. You're officially dead. By legal definition, you're a monster with no inheritable blood. You don't have to like it, but you're living the game agony right now. So I've been explaining in my video that it's one side of a light hole is a black hole and you're living on the E-Creation Discourse CD. And every compass is pointing to the very center of the dish where the astral jet comes shooting out. That's the Aurora Borealis. This is God. That's why, if you look up, you'll see that this is like the memory of the Earth. This is like the Akashic Record. This is the goddess. This is the why women do hula hooping and body dancing. It's, it's the Great Spirit. And every compass is pointing to the Holy Grail. There's no way to screw it up. They rub this shit in your face in videos and movies and every year you set up your Christmas tree and it's pointing to where Jesus the Son places his light into the hole and you see he's on a cross. That's the unfolded cube which is showing you everything is right there hiding in plain sight. It's one side of a light hole. It's a black hole with the green astral jet shooting out. That's called the Aurora Borealis. That's, that is God. That is the earth's memory the earth's spirit there's no way to fuck it up the earth is flat it's the division symbol the sun above is going round and round and round bringing the seasons and the sun below is fixed and it's 800 nautical miles in diameter so that the green astral jet can come shooting out hit the parabolic mirror and shower down on you there's no way to fuck this up so people say oh can i make this any easier for you to understand it's the division symbol there's no way to fuck it up the sun above and the sun below have a hole that they transfer the information and light through. It's just that simple. We need to get to the other side of the fence through the Holy of Holies at the center of the dish. Let me borrow your toes for a few minutes. I'll keep you covered and warm. I just want to 
lots of toast. And you can pee pee on me if you want. Oh, that's what I need. Those. The little piggy. I can get really, to be getting really good. The brand's at 36.57. Now we get to see the ones from Mommy and Daddy.